Oh, hey, what's going on? Uh, you're asking what's going on today at PC911? Well, I'll tell you what I got over here. I got a, an Acer Predator that was getting hot. And I'm going to show you why it was getting hot. Sheesh. Is this all disconnected? I mean, check out these fans. That is pretty nasty. So I'm going to switch it. So I'm going to switch over here to my camera phone. So basically, yeah, that's what we got. An Acer Super Nasty. This is the heat sink. I mean, that's pretty bad. So we're going to clean up the fans, clean it up, reapply some uh, fresh thermal paste. One of the fans might be seized up. Looks like it might be uh, have to be changed. We'll see once we uh, get it cleaned up. And uh, I'll show you what's going on here after we get this wrapped up. Hey guys, so I cleaned these fans out. We'll see how this one's probably going to work. This one, probably not. It's not spinning right. So, it's how nasty they were. Here we got the heat sink. You couldn't see that on the video because it's just so... It was just dark in there. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, there you go. So, I don't know. This is like a massive buildup. So, obviously, if you let your computer get like that, you're not going to be gaming. I'm surprised it was cooling as well as it as it was. Apparently, you know, this cooling system is pretty awesome because the flow here had to be in less than 50% because one fan wasn't spinning. And... You know, the other, you had all that clutter uh, clogged up. So, pretty good system. We'll see how it goes uh, when we get this cleaned up. How does that look? A little better? Or much better? So, there we go. Okay. Well, this side was always, you know, cleaned up. It was just all smack dab in there. All right, so we're going to see what's going on here, if these fans are both working or if one's working or what. Yep, so it's cranking. They're both working. This one, obviously, this is a CPU, and it's a higher speed fan. And then you got that GPU there. Yeah, hey, running. I opened up, like, this Call of Duty. Uh, whoa. Well, here's the Predator sense. It gives you the speeds of the... CPU and the GPU. That GPU was at zero before, so it's cranking. And uh, yeah, so I kind of opened up. This is still, is it running? I guess it is. So we got this uh, running, and that's what's, you know, making those fans crank up. So we're good to go. The temperature. Let's take a look. Uh, this has an update. Uh, no, I do not want to do that. Temperature is way down. Let me open up core temp right here. Yeah, like I'm using recording and opening up the stuff and terrible video but just a little vlog what do we got 48 degrees 50 degrees <clears throat> super cold of course you know this is open so it's getting a little more flow but still <clears throat> i mean we're talking about 50 degrees the cores i mean it's not really cranking though let's see come on people yeah, it's pretty idle. This game is really not running. Let me, uh... Okay, so here's a little better. We're running the CPU cores now a little higher. Actually, let me go back to this. Uh... 59 on the GPU. 
that was hitting 90, 95, and the FPS was dropping down to 30, I guess, throttling down. And let's go back to Seventy, eighty degrees, seventy-two, not even eighty degrees. All right, so we'll run some real stress tests after this and re do a bit a little bit better recording. But it's looking good. So here we go. Pretty much wrapped it up. We got the uh, couple stress. Uh, we got a stress test in the back running you can see the cpu cores there running at 100 percent the other two at 85 90 all right we got our temperatures right there and then this one keeps track of the highest temperature so max has been 75 gpu temperature right there at 81 i'm um, 51 whoops so this thing is running super cool So that's what we got right there. Acer Predator was running hot. Couldn't play. Uh, FPS was scaling down, stuttering. And just cleaned, opened it up, cleaned out the fans. And we're good to go. So we got one happy customer. We'll be gaming, I guess, tomorrow. And that's what's going on today at PC911.